Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Unique Tarot. This is going to be a reading for the sign of Pisces, okay? If you're new to the channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button and also give me a thumbs up, okay? If you would like a personal reading, how you can purchase one is down in the description box, okay? This is going to be a, re a reading around love. This is going to be new love or a renewal and an old love. So we'll see what's coming out, okay? We'll see what comes out. All right. So messages, spirit guys, in the universe for my Pisces. What's the message for my Pisces? In love or a, a new love or around an old love? What's the messages for Pisces, Piscean? New love or old love, spirit, for my Pisces? New love or old love for my Pisces, please. What's the messages for my Pisces around love? Okay. What's the messages for my Pisces? We have the lovers in reverse. The deck is not in reverse, so we're going to take it. So there's a breakup here. Okay. So if there's if this the lovers in reverse, this is probably a past person. Okay. There's a breakup here and a soul connection. All right, yeah, five of swords because somebody's jealous of addictive plays mind games, seven of pentacles. Somebody could be looking back on how they played mind games, lied, tried to one up, was deceitful. Okay, and now they're looking back on the relationship. Yeah, ten of cups, and now they're realizing how happy you made them. Okay, yeah, page of swords stalking you with the page of swords here. Okay, somebody could also be jealous because you're in a, because you broke up with them and you're happy in a new relationship. Yes, yeah, seven of wands. You've rejected this person here, or you will be if they try to come back. Is what I'm hearing. You no longer feel the same. Is what I'm hearing. The emotions are not the same. Yeah, queen of wands. This person is very, very attracted to you here, Pisces. Okay. Yeah, the magician in reverse. You find this person to be a manipulator, a liar, somebody that plays games. Yeah, the higher front. Okay. This is going to be someone that you are in a relationship with now. Okay. Or, or a past person. You have the Eight of Swords in reverse that you that you are no longer attached to. With the Seven of Wands, Eight of Swords. Yeah, you have your guards up. Nine of Wands. You no longer want anything to do with this person. This could be somebody that was married. And you found that out with the Page of Swords. Okay. But this person could be very jealous with the five of swords, watching you in a commitment now, in a relationship. Very happy in this relationship as well with the ten of cups. And this person is jealous. All right. Yeah, this is definitely someone from your past that can't that can't let go. You've definitely let go of the past. The six of cups wanted to come out in the reverse. You've definitely let go of this energy. You're no longer connected to this person or anything. Okay, yeah, you've ghosted it with the hermit. But this person is jealous from your past. It could be an earth sign, a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, or it could be an air sign, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. It could even be an air, uh, uh, fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Yeah, the world in reverse. This person doesn't want things to end with you, but you're over it with the King of Swords, Queen of Swords, Libra energy. You're like, no. You went cold on this motherfucker, like, no. They play too many mind games. Yeah, you're doing something new, Ace of Pentacles. You have a better offer with somebody else here. And somebody is jealous and mad. Yeah, the emperor, somebody that could be a business owner, the head of a household. You could possibly even be working with this person with the Three of Pentacles. Or somebody could ask you to. Yeah, Ace of Cups, Ace of Wands, you're doing something new. And you're actually very happy here. Yeah, Four of Pentacles. You're holding on to this new relationship here, Pisces. What's the Five of Swords up there? You don't want this past person at all. You've over the past with the Six of Cups in reverse. You got the Seven of Wands. That's rejecting, guarding. The Nine of Wands. That's rejecting. That's guarding. Yeah. Yeah. We have the Five of Swords with the Two of Cups and the Ace of Wands. Somebody's mad because a soulmate connection with them ended. And now you're in a new soulmate connection. Very passionate with the Two of Cups. Yeah. You've walked away from this past uh, relationship. Eight of Cups. Two of Swords. You're closed off. Done. You're not willing to reconcile that situation. Two of Wands, you made the best decision. Two of Wands is making a good decision here. 
and you feel like that's the best decision is to move on. Yeah, this person you broke up with, they want to return with that Eight of Cups that wanted to come out in reverse. They want to come in, but you've moved on and fast. And this person with that Five of Swords is jealous. They could even try to break up your situation. So you need to protect your relationship with the Seven of Wands, Pisces. Because this person plays dirty. Five of Swords plays dirty. They play to win. Okay? Yeah, this X, Three of Swords that popped out. Okay, could be a Libra. Yeah, with the justice, definitely could be a Libra. Or they could have Libra in their chart. But this person from your past is coming in that you left out in the cold, five of pentacles. They feel left out in the pole. But this was karmically meant to occur with that justice and this will of fortune for this to happen. For this person to watch you be happy with somebody else. Now, that was a soulmate connection. A deep one. But that's over with, with the lovers in reverse. Okay, now you're happy with this new. Ace of Wands represents new. It's a lot of attraction, passion, something stable, stability here with the two of cups and the ace of wands. And it moved fast. And this somebody here is jealous as fuck. Yeah, look at that. I said jealous in the five of wands. Yep. This person's jealous as fuck. They want to come out of conflict with you. But it's not going to happen because you've moved on. Yeah. Ace of cups in, fell out in the reverse. And then the king of swords fell out in the upright. Yeah, you're over it. This definitely could be an air sign or somebody with heavy air in their chart. Okay. All right. The love is gone. You don't have the passion there for that person. Yeah, the chariot. You've moved on. You don't have the passion, the love, the anything for this person from your past anymore. Okay. You're happy. You're doing something new. Yeah, ten of swords. That's over. And you've moved on. Yep, six of swords. Could be you could have, yeah, you've gained clarity and, and you know that it's best for you to move on here. Okay. It could be with an earth sign. It could be with an air sign. With this king of swords sitting up like this. You've been getting the king of swords in your reading for a minute now, Pisces. So you could be uh, maybe somebody in the military you moved on quickly with. Okay. And you left this water sign behind with the eight of cups, ace of cups. Okay. You could have left this water sign behind and moved quickly toward this air sign. All right. And somebody from your past is jealous as fuck. So this new love is taking off. It's stable. It's everything you need. And with, with the five of swords, five of wands, somebody's very jealous and uh, very uh, vindictive. You you were right to walk away from that situation here. Okay, Pisces, you was right to walk away from that. Because you do not want to be in a relationship with somebody who is like that. Who tries to win. Okay. Some spirit is telling me to pull a little bit more. Yeah, this is the ex. Somebody you left out in the cold and you reject it. If this person tries to come around, you're going to reject them. Just period. Yeah, Knight of Cups in reverse. This could be a water sign. Yep. Injustice showed itself again. Yeah, Ten of Swords showed itself. It's over. Okay, and that's this person's karma. Maybe for being a liar, a jealous person, a vindictive person, a nasty person. Okay. This is their karma for that. Okay, yeah, page of wands. You could be dealing with a fire sign, something new here. Somebody could have juggled you, two of pentacles. Yeah, three of wands. You're no longer waiting for and expecting or anything from this person. If this person reaches out with the judgment card, you will not be responding with the will of fortune in reverse. This will not be moving forward. Okay? Period, point blank. What's the three of swords in? What's that three of swords with the three of pentacles up there? Yeah, judgment. You made a judgment call to leave this person out in the cold. Yep, five of cups. You're not disappointed, sad, or anything. You feel like that's the best decision for you, this new relationship. And it is. It's a twin flame relationship or soulmate connection that you're moving toward. You left one soulmate to connection to go right into a new one. And look at the king of wands in reverse. Somebody's mad, jealous, vindictive, evil, and hateful. This can even be somebody abusive. Okay, but this is their karma. Now they got to live in this energy for being who they was to you, to other people or whatever. Karma is real and it happens. All right, so let's get a couple cards for my Pisces, please. Spirit, God, angels, universe, Piscean. What's the messages for my Pisces, please, Spirit? What's the messages for my Pisces? Yeah, separation, time apart from your partners on the horizon. Yeah, you separated. Yeah, unrequited love right here. Okay, you don't feel the same for this person. There's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going. Yeah, you don't feel the same for this past person anymore. You found your true love here. 
Yeah, it's the romance of a lifetime. Yeah. And you trust this new person as well. To be honest, straight, straightforward. Yeah. Let go of control issues. Yeah. Okay. Allow this situation to unfold naturally. Yeah. You're allowing it to unfold and take and, and um, go where it needs to go here. We had give your relationship a chance in reverse. So you don't want to give this past person a chance. Yeah, it says this could be the one. You freed yourself. You retreated from this past person. And you feel like this new person is the one for you. They make you happy here. What's the messages for my Pisces? Spirit guides, angels, universe of the white light for my Pisces. What is the messages for my Pisces spirit, guys, and angels, Pisces in love, this new person in this past year. Give me information on this, please, for my Pisces. All right. We have um, wedding rings, union, wedding, married, soul connection, eternal love, everlasting promise. Yeah, this new relationship is going to lead to a higher level of commitment, engagement here. Golden marriage, self-absorbed, narcissist, one-sided relation, and love bombing. Yeah, this... In the past, you dealt with somebody who was a one-sided relationship. They want There was a narcissist. They wanted to play games, and they're the one that got played. The dragonfly, big, um, being lighthearted, finding out things come to light, adapt and change, heal. Yeah, and it flew out over here on this past energy. Yeah, you, saw, you see this person for who they are now. You know this person? Yeah, the snake. Look at that. At the bottom, snake. Competition, enemy, clever, malicious. Look over your shoulder, the other woman. Yeah, with the five of swords, that's the malicious card. This person is malicious. They're going to try to fuck up what you have going on, Pisces. Okay, so be very careful with that. I'm just letting you know. So what's the messages from your person? What's the messages from your person for for uh, Pisces, please? What's the messages from Pisces person? What's the messages from Pisces person, please? Messages from Pisces person. Okay, we have, um, I want to impregnate you and why didn't I uh, make better decisions? So this past person wants to know why they didn't make better decisions. They wanted to get you pregnant or this could be this new person that's going to get you pregnant here. It says, um, I'm working on myself to come back to you. So this past person is working on themselves wanted to come back to you but i see that when they decide to do that they're working in vain because you don't want them back you do not want this past person back that is clear you're done you're over it period it says i promise to never hurt you again yeah and i'm so proud of how far you've come so yeah i should have chose you so this person feels like they should have chose you maybe they should have because you definitely move forward to something new loving abundant and stable and lasting okay they said, um, I'll never hurt. They're saying now they'll never hurt you again. But this person isn't to be trusted. And you know this with the five of swords. You know this in the five of wands. You know this person is jealous. Your, your, your intuition is telling you to block this person. Okay, to reject this person. Okay. So those are the messages I have for you, Pisces. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the post notification bell so you do not miss an upload. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.